Hey, there's like a hundred other benches in this mall. Go find one. Psst. Look. Seriously, I will not hesitate to punch you in the junk. Trey? Yeah, it's me, but keep it down. I'm indiscreto. I think you mean incognito? Whatever, I just don't want Samoa Joe to find me. I'm pretty sure he's not here. Good, but just in case, look off into the distance when you're talking to me. I tried calling you all week, but your phone went straight to voicemail. That's because I smashed it. I'm also wearing different deodorant to throw Samoa Joe off my trail. Can't be too cautious. And I don't know if you heard, but Joe ended up costing me my money in the bank qualifying match. You poked the bear and then ran away leaving me to deal with him. I'm sorry, and I'll make it up to you somehow, but don't get hot because I'm the universal champion. That's not what this is about. Are you sure you're not a tiny bit jealous I won a title in WWE before you when you're supposed to be the in-ring star? And I did it when I wasn't even an official member of the roster. I mean this in the nicest way, but you got lucky. I reversed a coquina clutch into a pin. That's not luck. I'm the one who taught you that when we were training in Calgary. Fine. Then I guess this is yours. Take it. Stop. One of the reasons I was trying to get a hold of you is Randy Orton wants to give you a short-term Raw contract. So congrats, you got what you wanted, at least as long as you're champion. Yes! I mean, yes. Don't get too excited. Orton also wanted me to let you know you're defending your title on Monday. Hmm. Let me guess, against Samoa Joe? No. He's mad at Joe for letting this turn into the single worst thing to ever happen in WWE. His words. So instead, you're going to face Brock Lesnar. Cool. You sure you don't want this? Sorry, you got yourself into this. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE Universal Championship. Corey, what do you think of the champ's chances here tonight? I love them. I'm not like everybody else, Cole. It seems like everybody's ready to write the champ's demise, but not me. And by the looks of things, I would say the champ is in no mood for playing games here tonight. Nor should he be, Michael. The moment the champ takes the pedal off the medal is the moment he'll lose that title. The longest reigning Universal Champion in history! The Beast, the Conqueror, the Mayor of Suplex City, Brock Lesnar has earned every nickname bestowed upon him. 
the most decorated combat athlete in the world, gracing WWE with his presence. Someone's gonna take a trip to Suplex City. Yeah, that's almost guaranteed. Brock Lesnar is ready for a fight. Introducing the challenger from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 295 pounds, Brock Lesnar! And introducing the champion from no place in particular, weighing in at 170 pounds, he is the WWE Universal Champion. Luis! Winning the Universal title makes you the guy in WWE. Between interrupting and defeating Samoa Joe and essentially going into hiding before being awarded a temporary Raw contract, it's certainly been a Roller coaster of a week for our Universal Champion Trey. Our GM wants that roller coaster ride to come to a screeching halt. So much so that he convinced Brock Lesnar to compete in a non pay per view match for the first time in years. It doesn't take a genius to predict that this will be the first and last time Trey defends the Universal Championship. Hey, no one thought he'd be in this position tonight, but he somehow pulled that off. Never say never. Never. Great reversal. I gotta say, I'm impressed. Ooh, and scissors whoa, take down. Whoa, whoa. Very nice. In addition to owning one of the most impressive championship resumes, Byron, we should also mention that Brock Lesnar has a Royal Rumble match to his credit. You're absolutely right, Michael. In 2003, Lesnar last eliminated The Undertaker to forever etch his name in history as a Royal Rumble match victor. He's just dominating at this point. He is just dominant right now. Oh, from the top! face of Brock Lesnar look like it's been through a wood chipper. More on Brock Lesnar's dominant 2003. Not only did he win the Royal Rumble that year, but Corey... Brock counters with the F5. It's Samoa Joe. Wait, he's got Paul Heyman in the Coquina clutch. Why? Is he insane? And now the Beast is headed straight for Samoa Joe. Joe's unloading on Brock with that baseball bat. Wait, the, the bell just rang. I, I think the referee disqualified Trey for Samoa Joe attacking Brock. Trey still retains the Universal Championship. That's my Universal title, and I'm going to take it back. Not anyone else. So, Randy Orton, until you give me my rematch, get used to this happening over and over again. <laughs> 